Welcome back to Iterace. This is week 189, day two of Chaos Season. And we'll jump into the battle. We have time, but we'll watch the replay later. Um, we'll see what we get. Druid dude. Weaponless dancer. Alright, um... Yeah. Can Fjorm outspeed you? It's basically what it comes down. Can Fjorm outspeed you? Fjorm has 51 speed. You have 41 speed and you have 46 speed. Of course, you both get extra speed, but I don't have to have anybody here. I can even break this and have someone here to bait him to come straight down away from Ravelous and then just bait from like here. Legion, of course, is going to be the bigger pain of all, but. It's got to be this team. Now, are there any rallies or anything weird like that? No. So... I guess we can isolate you to get rid of your um, extras. No, you have a rouse, which is you have to be solo, right? Yeah. How about you? You have Sea Feud. Um, technically, we can stop your Cedar Shell, so that might be what we go after. I think we should go after Cedar Shell then. Uh, I go over here. And yeah. We don't want anybody here, so. kind of would like to, I would prefer to have um, Bylef to be able to go over here just so I can go after Fafnir afterwards, but for right now this is the way we're gonna go. Nothing can get to over here. Um, yeah, I mean... I'll break this just so I can bait Fafnir to come drown. Because I need him to not go this way, basically. I'll tread lightly. Truly? I see. Leave it to me. It will be done. Maybe this way. Although he Leave might want to go after Bylef, but we'll see. Oh yeah, there's that. I always forget about that. Truly, ready. I see. Cause cab lines. All right. Light City goes first, which means we do kill um, Legion. Regan. Doesn't do not any damage at all. Yeah. All right, here comes. Yeah, that really doesn't matter. You are the main target. Can Element finish you off? Not a chance. Yes. It will be done. I will protect you. All right, that was what we wanted. Leave it to me. I'll tread lightly. I will go. Got it. Hmm. Not really a way for me to get Ike over there. Leave it to me. Like over here, I mean. Got it. 
guess I should have swap out no never mind speak I'll tread lightly leave it to me I mean it really doesn't matter I mean we have a lot of time I will go it isn't like we're hurting on time or anything like that Sarah's is basically dead. And then we just get the ether and that's it. I'll tread lightly. Weaponless dancers. This is very little point to going with a weaponless dancer. Doesn't really matter where I go. Leave it to me. Hmm. He's gonna let Ah Mirabilis Ready. go down to Peony. Truly, I see. Leave it to me. Can I give her any more attack? Good morning. Not really. one extra turn but yeah like weaponless answers is just oh, especially on a setup like this like what is the point no one going after your uh your dancer is just not gonna attack anything like right off the bat your ether is way at the front so i mean it's a cab line, so all it does is just attack once and win or lose, and that's it. But I don't know, I don't see the point of the weaponless dancers. All right, so now let's take a look at that one defense replay or two now. This, I guess, came in while we were playing. So yeah, um, I knew one team, one problem that my team was gonna have is gonna be near safe, and yeah, Hector, especially something like Hector, because they, yeah, I mean it's Hector. <laughs> what do you want? Uh, Summer Edelgar and Dagger, which comes in really in handy over here because of her Pathfinder. Alright, so they do something very smart over here, and they go on turn 1. Uh, of course, uh, since they got Edelgar, she can swap in if this is the fake trap, I mean the real trap. But they went after Marv, and is the, this is like the best time to go after Marv because he has no buffs. Because he's pre-turn 1. Now they're beating a unit, which her being a flyer unit and dagger. Uh, I forgot it. this dagger is bonus of air or um, inflicts. Yeah, she is combo with into space of an ally, inflicts all stats minus five and four during combat, and inflicts penalties on foes equals to current bonus energy units. Yeah, so she's um, 
what is it called? Ah, uh, pleasure and effect. And yeah, Bolt Tower. Can't do anything about a Bolt Tower. This week, Bolt Tower will be very strong. I'll study your technique. Yeah, like we would have been able to tank an Edelgar, but Bolt Tower. And obviously, Ike is not gonna go after Edelgar because color disadvantage. Go for it. Sit. This is it. Yes. What she said. Yeah, and Ines is pretty much just a player face unit. Again, he's not gonna go after Edgar, so. Pierce the sky, Maltet. Here's why I said like Pathfinder comes super in handy for them right here. Not because of her own Pathfinder, but her ability to give everybody Pathfinder. All right, and then this one, which again can be what we were playing. So, is there another near sa save Hector? Yep, another near save Hector. This time's plus ten, plus fifteen, and so much support. So yeah, if we couldn't handle the other one, this is just oh, come on, plus ten Luthier, and so yeah. Plus 10, plus 10, plus 10. So I just bait out uni. Huh? Which... How much speed does that Hector hit? 31? I didn't see how many shots. Because, like, uh, she has an impact skill. So technically... She's able to beat. All right, here they. Ah, uh, because Morph was in the front line, they didn't get tricked into going after him. Lynn, you're a wonder. Accept your punishment. And that does thirty-seven. So yeah. Brave weapons are. Something that is going to affect Marv heavily. So I will go after Peony. Well, actually. And, man, I wish I had um, Dragon Ball to give uh, Grima. Does she have a Tempest skill? Oh, Tempest, okay. That was so close. If that was... Oh, that was so close. That's enough. Go for it. This is it. Yes, what she said. Get Ike before he heals. How much speed? 45 speed. Oh, yeah. Lol and life and death. And yeah, like they they didn't see her being they didn't see him being able to take another hit. That's why they gave up on that ether. Plus turn seven actually. So yeah, 
they weren't able to get the ether. Which, like I said uh, yesterday, well, getting the ether is probably going to be one of the hardest things this week. Um, okay, so we do have some news. So, if you all well, remember, you all know about the bug from yesterday, so... Um, since they really can't fix it, like, in any kind of way, like, give you, refund you your ether or anything like that, because there's no way to know whether you would have lost a match regardless or not. Uh, they're just gonna give everybody, um, the top, um, the top tier rewards, just... Uh, because a lot of people are going to be at a disadvantage. Like, for example, I should never be losing 60 points because I put Yune on the team to prevent myself from losing 60 points. But because she was on the sixth slot, she got dropped, and then my score went from losing 40 to losing 60. Um, and like I said, no one won't, like having a level one fortress. Unless you got like a lucky kill, you like, I don't know, you want to kill something like because she has an auto double and you had like a blue unit with like triangle attack or something like that, then yeah, you were most likely not gonna use a lose a unit. Uh, but yeah, so that everybody getting top rewards means basically, um, you'll, I don't know if those, uh, that will affect rank as well. Uh, because even with your losses, you should still be able to come in 1 to 3k if that's where you usually score. But regardless, so if they give everybody only the top um, rewards, you will be uh, 35 grails, 44, um, what's that, armor flowers? and 50 grails, I mean, uh, not grails, codes, um, tier 39, again, those 60 points you lost, or whatever points you lost at the beginning of the week might cost you tier 39, so, uh, but tier 39 has 55 infantry flowers, which is really good, infantry flowers are the best, uh, 250 ether stones and 60 grails, and of course, defense is more infantry flowers so this week is pretty good for them to give everybody top rewards because infantry flowers are the best uh other than that that is pretty much it um so day one video like it took me um i uploaded it and it's been uploaded if i'm talking in the past right now like as of right now it has i haven't made it live but because I was trying to find this, like, I always put, like, the season thing on it, but I was trying to find a picture of this, um, the KO season emblem, um, I could not find it anywhere, like, l I tried it, uh, size that, uh, data mine, all the fair repositories, um, the wikis, everything, just to see, like, they had the picture of the emblem of the Dark Season, so I could put it on the thumbnail, like I usually do, but I could not find it anywhere, I have no idea why, and um, there's this side, like, it tells you how to data mine, but you have to upload, it pretty much only be done in your computer, and then you have to download a program, I was like, uh, let me not do that, but yeah, I, if you, if you can find this little emblem right here, uh, can you uh, just give me a link to it uh, on the on a comment? Just put a comment with a link to it. Uh, I try to find it everywhere. Like I, all the other ones, they're online. You can get them, and then they're, they have a transparent look. So, uh, but I could not find this stupid little symbol right here, just so I could like put on the thumbnail for properly keeping in that tab spot I couldn't find it I spent hours looking for it uh, but yeah that is pretty much for this week though um, hopefully we can use a more interesting team than just 
far safe for tomorrow but uh, yeah that's it for today so thank you all for watching i'll see you all next time bye